What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash, smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is free general collective reading for all signs. Cast through side to everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate. Leave the rest. Free general collective reading. Love you guys so much. I do, I do, I do. -do. All right, I've received another channeling at 7, 12 a.m., 11, 25, 2022. Hope everybody's doing well. Okay, so the channel message I received was someone who once thought something was hilarious. I heard very immature energy. And, you know, you can be 20 to 99 plus and be immature it's mentally, not phys physical age. Um, they're very, they thought something was so hilarious, mentally immature energy. Um, I heard... Um, now, um, they are forced to wake up and see the reality of things, and they do not think it's funny anymore. They're about to take some huge action. Um, there are still people that think it's hilarious, and they're about to get a huge-ass wake-up call soon. Very out of line and disrespectful. Okay, so you plug it in, it resonates. So we've got one, this could be you or somebody you're connected to, somebody that was very immature in the past, but they had basically matured. And they thought something was so hilarious in the past, but now they're forced to wake up and see the rea real reality of things, and they don't think it's funny anymore. They're about to take huge action. Well, congratulations if that's you, sir or ma'am. You've matured. You grew up. Good for you. And then there's other people that still think it's funny, but they're about to get a huge-ass wake-up call um, in their life. So it could be something going on with them or, so, or the situation or what have you, what have you. But they still think it's hilarious. They're still immature, whatever, whatever, whatever. But they're about to get a huge ass wake up call regardless. But they still think it's funny. Whatever it is. Um, huge criminal acts. Huge. Huge criminal acts. Oh, okay. So they think huge criminal acts are funny. Well, imagine if the huge criminal acts were done against them. Would they think it's so funny? And that's just the truth. No, uh, but one of you guys, I feel, or somebody you're connected to, or somebody's about to watch this video, they have matured. They have matured, masculine or feminine. This could be you or somebody you're connected to. Somebody has matured in this situation over the criminal acts. They once thought it was funny, but now they're waking up and realizing the real truth of the situation. They don't think it's funny, and they're about to take action. Congratulations if you resonate over here. I feel like I need to get earth magic. Spirit messages, you have a question. Communion. Instinct reversed. I would take it reversed. Someone is about to start having serious nightmares about the past. Serious nightmares. It is about to wake them up in a huge way. A very huge way. About these criminal acts of the past. Attempted sex trafficking, human trafficking. Okay. Someone, uh, someone's about to start having severe nightmares of the past of attempted sex trafficking and human trafficking. So it's about to wake them up. It could be you or these people. Or, well, they're going to get wake-up calls. But somebody in this mix, you don't think it's funny anymore. The human trafficking, sex trafficking. You thought it was hilarious in the past, but you don't anymore. I heard attempted. So um, attempted human trafficking, sex trafficking. Um, there was a lot of money made off this. It really was trafficking. Okay, I heard there was a lot of money made off this. It really was trafficking. So, actually, it really was trafficking um, because there was a lot of money made off of it. So, 
but you don't think it's funny anymore because you woke up and seen the reality that people made money off children or people um, and basically abused and exploited them and sex trafficked them. Um, now, were they carted off? Maybe, may not, but a lot of money was made off them. Um, they might not have been carted off and thrown into the back of a semi and carted across county lines but or country lines, but a shit ton of money was made off them, i.e. the sex trafficking, human trafficking. But you're waking up and you're realizing it now. You thought it was so hilarious in the past, but you don't anymore. For these people, they still think it was hilarious that somebody uh, money was made off them for human trafficking or sex trafficking, but they're about to get a huge wake-up call. Somebody in this mix is about to start getting nightmares about this shit. They're about to start getting nightmares about it. And um, it's about to make them start taking some action. Now, whatever the action is, I don't know if it's therapy. I don't know if it's calling and reporting it to the National Sex Trafficking Hotline. Or the ch if it's Children Child Abuse Hotline or Child Protective Services. However, that resonates and applies. But it's not, it's not funny to make money off anybody for abuse and exploitation. I don't care if they're... Uh, carted off in a semi truck and carted across country lines, county lines, state lines, or not. And that's just the truth. You should never abuse and exploit anybody, period, point blank, children or human. And seek reverse. The cycle has ended. Many people got very rich off this. It is about to backfire on them in a huge way through unexpected ways they would have never expected, and it's about to happen soon. Okay, I heard many people got rich off this in the past. Many people did. Um, off making money, off of abusing and exploiting children or adults or both. Um, I'm feeling it possibly could be Secret 7, but I didn't hear it was. But how that resonates, whether it is or isn't, many people made a shit ton of money off this. So, I heard the cycle's ended. So, the instinct has ended. The exploitation and abuse of kids or humans or whoever adults or whoever whoever has ended a shit ton of money was made off of it the instinct is reversed there's no more money making off of adults kids or a sex or whoever 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 but they did make a shit ton of money off of it i.e they sexually abused and exploited people whether it's kids adults or whatever whatever uh, but people don't think, this person doesn't think it's funny anymore. These people still do, but they're about to get huge wake-up calls. But I heard these people that made a shit ton of money off abusing and exploiting kids, humans, people, or whatever, whatever in the past, they're about to start experiencing huge negative power moments, um, regardless. And I heard it unexpected ways they would have never expected. They secretly withheld information from you in the past. It is about to backfire on them in a huge way. They are sex traffickers. They secretly withheld um, information from you in a huge way in the past. I heard they are sex traffickers. And yeah, they are. They are abusing and exploiting people and they made money. Um, I've been pulling in a legal business in the past. It might be that sex trafficking business. It might be something else, but... If you make money off of something you're not supposed to make off of, i.e. some kind of sexual situation, whether it's adults, kids, or whatever, we have you, and it's not you, and you don't have authorization and consent to do it, that's sex trafficking, and that's just the truth. I don't care if they're carted off on a semi-truck across county or country lines or not. Um, look at the little chart that I posted on the community tab, if anybody needs some clarification on that. So the sex trafficking is um, ended, but... A lot of these people are about to be labeled as sex traffickers, and somebody is about to do something about this in a huge way. Okay, I heard a lot of these people are about to be labeled as sex traffickers, and um, uh, people are about to do something about this in a huge way. Well, they should be. They should. They should. Because somebody's about to start having nightmares about this. This is uh, telepathic energy here, but this is dreamscape in this uh, situation with the nightmares. Because they're having nightmares because they know somebody got sex trafficked in the past or about to start having nightmares. Yeah. 
I would never want to be a part of that. That's not good for mental health or physical health. And that's just the truth. I love you guys. Namaste.